Hello guys, if you're new to the channel, my name is Talor, this is Talor Invests, uh, and if you're subscribed, welcome back to the uh, channel. With a new video today guys, I have brought this underrated penny stock for you guys. It's trading at just 27 cents a share currently, and it has the potential to do what ABML did in a month, which was a 2,000% increase from 27 cents to $3, and let's hop right into this video. So, Global Battery Metals Lim Limited. Um, ticker symbol REZZF is a mineral exploration company with a focus on metals that make up and support the rapid evolution to battery power. That's EV right there. That's pretty. That's pretty significant right there. Um, the sectors this company's work impacts are huge right now in terms of hype and speculation, and I therefore believe this company has loads and loads of potential. So um, they're currently listed on the. TSX Venture Exchange, the OTC Markets, and Frankfurt. So um, they currently have two projects, and one number one is an option to acquire up to 90% of the Northwest lines there. I believe that's how you say it. Lithium property in Ireland. Um, the all the information is on screen right now, I believe, and um, the Northwest lines. The project summarized is basically focused on the exploration for lithium mineralization if you guys want to read more about this it is quite wordy um, so I suggest reading it over and over again it will take you a bit of time uh, but the link will be in the description box down below and a the second one is a 55% stake in Peru based Laura Cop Copper property which has over 10,000 meters of drilling so that's pretty significant right there uh, and as previously um, disclosed in press releases, um, Minsa SA, a Peru ma mining, co a Peruvian mining company, entered into an option agreement with Global Battery Metals Limited and Lara Exploration Limited to acquire the Lara property for staged payment 5.75 million USD. And um, Global Battery Metals Limited, I'm just going to call them GBML, even though that's not their ticker. So just remember their ticker is R E. Double ZF. So GBML will retain a 0.75% sorry percent net smelter royalty. So they're going to make a, a royalty off of their basically their net um, income from um, the property. So um, this is in their press release of July 28th, 2020. So if you guys want to see that, just go into their press releases on the website. The link will also be in the description box down below. And um, yeah, that's the information for that, and I just thought I'd mention this. They did have an offering, um, and this was in their recent press release on January the 25th, I believe, and you guys won't believe what happened, but basically, they obviously raised the money through an offering with gross proceeds of 170k, selling one point, over 1 1.4 million units for 0 0.1, um, I believe, and despite the offering, this thing that there wasn't a sell-off like it was insane they went um, from 11 cents to 24 cents in a day so from 20 the 25th of January when this thing was announced this private um, offering they went from 11 cents to 24 cents that's 118 percent increase in a day right after an offering so you guys know there is hype around this company there's building hype around it so that people do know about it and um, I haven't seen any YouTube videos on it just yet, but I do anticipate there will be some soon, which is why I'm trying to sneak in right now, um, making a video for you guys right now. But anyway, um, since the run, it has obviously corrected down to 17 cents. That's pretty obvious, um, a healthy correction right there. Not dropping to their 11 cent um, low right there. So we are at 17 cents. And they look to, that, that dip looks to have been capitalized on. And it's went on a run yesterday, from in increasing from 17 cents to 27 cents. So that's a 10 cent increase, a 60 percent increase. So guys, um, last but not least, I just thought I'd make a um, comparison between these guys and ABML. They are in the same sector. They both affect the EV industry, and mainly due to the EV hype. You guys, if you guys know what ABML is, you know what's happened to that. They've went from they went on a huge run. They went from um, being 27 cents, I believe, in December, um, 
around the 20th, something like that, I can't remember off the top of my head, to nearly a 2,000% increase over that from December to January um, in a month from around the same price as ticker symbol REZZF. So they were around the same price. And due to the EV hype and some other obviously announcements and catalysts, um, ABML did go up. And REZZF, they are increasing as well. So I think this is a this is a steal right now to have it at 24, uh, 27 sorry, cents a share. I'm going to be loading up 100 shares for $27 right now because that's a pretty nice steal. And the flip side... So I cut that twenty-seven could be worth three hundred dollars in um, the coming months, to, in the months to come. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, please, please drop a sub. Really appreciate it. Anyways, guys, I will see you in the next video. Peace.